y'all hey y'all welcome back to my channel it's me mystic beauty and um this is my third time trying to record this video that's why these cards are already laid out but i'm gonna keep it moving um the cards that are that came out were get ready for new horizons um support is all around you and it's time it's time for healing connecting mending and, and releasing um um, I feel like this is saying, you know, they get ready for some new things to come in your life. Um, and just know that you're being supported. That support is definitely all around you. And it's time for healing and connecting. I want to say connecting. I feel like connecting back to God, connecting back to the divine, you know, mending. Maybe you need to mend your heart. Maybe your heart needs mending. Um, and releasing, releasing pain, releasing burdens. You know, any anger, frustration, resentment, you have to release that shit. You got to release that in order for you to heal. Like, you can't heal if you're still holding on to, to um, you know, things that were done to you in the past. Like, I'm not saying forget it. I'm not, by no means forget what happened to you, but you definitely need to release, you know. And once you start, once you connect back to the divine, You'll start to heal. The universe is going to help you heal. Then it's going from it's going to go from healing to mending. Then it's go it's going to go from mending to releasing. You know? I like that message. I've tried to record this video three times, and I'm like, you know what? And this, you're ready for a new life. new horizons. Oh, this 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 card came out twice. I had put it back, and it came back out again. So I was about to keep it. Okay. These cards I'm using is the, um, the Spirit Animal Oracle deck. And they're like really beautiful. Universe, what other messages you have? What other messages you have? <clears throat> what other messages you have? These cards are hard to... What other messages do we have? Oh my god, this card came out again and I put it back. Wow. Okay. We got clear the clutter. It came out again. It was under the same spot. I put this card back. This message is definitely intended for somebody. It say clear the clutter. And it say get ready for new horizons. So I feel like, you know, if you can clear the, when, when it say clutter, I mean, I feel like it means mind clutter, you know, overthinking things, being stuck in your head constantly, taking too long to make decisions because you, you got this clutter in your head, this, this mind chatter. Um, the giraffe spirit is a see the big picture. And it's right under support. It's all around you. So it's kind of like once you clear out this clutter, you'll be able to see the big picture. And then it say, make your dreams real. Okay, so maybe somebody's like thinking about going back to school, um, getting a new job, moving, whatever it is that you want to do. Spirit wants you to know because make your dreams real is right under crossing bridges. So it's kind of like maybe it's like a bridge in your life or something that you 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 want to cross. Maybe you're afraid. Your know, spirit wants you to know that they're there. It's a support is all around you. It's time for healing, connecting, mending, and releasing. Let go of the past. Let go of the the mind clutter. So you can see the big picture. So you can make your dreams real. I love it. And under the deck we have the beaver spirit. It says lay a solid foundation. So once you pretty much lay out a solid foundation as to what you want to do. Once you lay this foundation out, you can get ready for these new horizons. God, God is going to send you support. You will be able to cross some new bridges. Once you clear out this, this mind clutter, you know, get to a place you should meditate. Get, get to a, a quiet place where you can, you know, you can be one with divine. So once you clear out this clutter, you will finally be able to see the big picture. And you'll finally be able to make your dreams real. You'll be able to manifest. I love it. It's beautiful. Maybe somebody thinking about traveling. 
traveling for school, traveling for work. I love it. That is beautiful. Okay. <coughs> it say you have what it takes. It say love in spite of it all. And it say change is always good. It say you have what it takes. So if you are thinking about make, making a change in your life, um, crossing new bridges, you know, going down a different path, you know, spirit wants you to know that not only are you supported, but you do have what it takes. You have what it takes. It's, it's already in you. It's already in you. It say, always follow your heart unless it's been broken. Then you must lead it. And then you must lead your heart. Only if, only if it's been broken. Sometimes, you know, we say, well, just follow your heart. Follow your heart. Your heart will never lead you wrong. But, you know, sometimes you have to make a head over heart decision. You know, then you got to lead your heart. It's a love in spite of it all. Okay, so, I mean, maybe someone has broken your heart. <clears throat> maybe somebody did something wrong to you. Maybe you were treated unfairly, you know. But it's a love in spite of it all. Love in spite of it all because at the end of the day, they're not going where you're going. You know, Divine has something special laid out for you. And waiting for you. You just you you just pretty much got to quiet your mind. You know, I think this kind of speaks of to me toxic people, getting toxic people out of your life, releasing, releasing toxicity out of your life, or just loving yourself, putting yourself first. And then it say change is always good. It say actually the only effective way of changing another person is to change yourself. So you know, no matter no matter what someone else has done, said to you, made made you feel, you know, you're not in control of them. You're only in control of yourself. And besides, where you're going, you can't take them with you. Sometimes, you know, you can't, well, all the time, you can't take toxic people with you. Change is always good. So if you are thinking about making a change, you know, just know that it's good. That it's probably for the best anyway. I love it. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. What else? I like these cards. So, I just feel like this message is, you know, Spirit is saying that right now you're probably crossing a major bridge in your life. But, you know, the light is leading you. Spirit is guiding you. You have support all around you. You know, get ready to go to these new places. You just need to, you know, clear your mind. Meditate on some things. Clear the clutter. That way you can see the big picture. Because you have what it takes. And love in spite of it all, no matter what. And But most importantly, put yourself first. And just remember that change is always good. <laughs> Anyways, give me an overall energy. Give me an overall energy. that victory you got victory coming to you you're heading towards victory so whatever it is that you're thinking about doing go for it you're being divinely guided anyway 
spirit is pretty much traveling with you. They're there, that beacon of light that's going to guide that dark path for you. You don't even need a flashlight, baby. They're going to guide. They're going to light that whole path for you. You have support all around you. You just need to go take some time to yourself, pray, meditate, ask the divine. What is it that you need? What that I need to know? Show me what I need to know. It's say make your dreams real. So whatever it is that you want to do, is it going back to school? Is it finding a new job? Moving? Whatever it is that you want to do, you have what it takes to make your dreams real. And I ask spirit, what is the overall energy of this reading? It's the victory card. You will have victory. I don't know who this message is for, but um, if it's resonating with you, please give the video a thumbs up. Comment, like, share. Look at this. Right under the deck. That's stability. Somebody heading towards some cho-chos. So whatever decision, whatever it is you're trying to figure out what you want to do, it's definitely leading you down a path of financial stability. Or just not even just financial stability, but just the being stable within yourself. Sometimes having a peace of mind is more important than, than money, period, anyway. You know, getting toxic people out of your life and just having that peace of mind is very important. I love it. I love it. Okay, y'all, I'm going to wrap this reading up. Um, like I said, if this message resonated with you, um, feel free to comment, like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Bye, y'all. I love y'all.